Yo, what's going on, Sexy Sam Lender Squad? So, first off, you might see the length of this video and be like, oh my god, I'm in heaven. Um, but basically, a viewer of mine, I don't know if they want me to say their name, so I won't say it, but a viewer of mine messaged me and was like, hey, I know you're moving and money is helpful right now. What about if I pay you $500 and you do a two hour feature of assassins only? The only, the only, uh, thing that I have to add is you cannot play any assassin twice. And I accepted a two hour video, basically a try hard Thursday. If you really think about it, a try hard Thursday, that's a little bit longer. That's assassin only. And if I play an assassin i can't play it again and i was like that sounds actually like a lot of fun so i'm down so today's video is going to be very long filled with assassins and uh i'm pretty sick just in general so i'm prepared i hope you guys are sit back relax um I guess I'll just go one point in everything, one point in each ability. I don't know if it's better on Kamazots to go for two points in your one and one point in your three, because you could bounce the one off them, get the extra power and then jump on them. And the extra power gives you more healing. Or if the healing from your two is actually just good enough. I, I assume the healing from my two is just good enough. Hello. Ow. He definitely outtraded me. But he did use all of his clear to do it. So I don't think that was actually that great for him. Yeah, I have a feeling that my... Uh, that my strat's actually a little bit better here. He does a little bit of damage, but... Overall, I'm chilling. Overall, I'm chilling. I do need to get my uh, two on him a little bit. Perfect. Oh, man. Look at that healing. Holy. That was actually so well played by me. I'm very happy with it. Nice. Big poking. Big poking. Oh, and the shell for no reason. That is a win for me. I'm going to grab this. He's probably just going to insta back. There's no way he's not backing, right? Oh, he isn't backing. Okay. Hello. Perfect. Very, very good for me. Okay, now... I want to see if I can do this buff and I need to get the last hit with my two in order to get the extra stack of my passive. So I'm just going to make it very easy. Very, very easy. And I think I'm going to go, oh man, I want to go transcendence, but dominance is like, I can already afford it. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's fine. Let's just go back. Let's just hit the B button. Get to the blue buff. And now I have my full passive. Hopefully he doesn't steal this. Perfect. Now I have my full passive. I can go get my transcendence. He's going into berserker shield. I guess it could be a glad shield technically, but let's be honest. Berserker shield makes more sense in this scenario. So there is no universe in where you kill me here. Oh, man, if that one hit, he was actually so dead. Oh, I missed. Mm. I need my one to hit here. Oh, no, no. No, dude. Oh, my God. That was so bad by me. I really, really thought... That my three would have gone off. But that knockup hit me a little faster than I expected it to. 
That knock up hit me a bit faster than I expected it to. Damn, that's really in fort. He's just gonna back up. Damn, dude. This is a very weird style. Very, very awkward style. Hmm. I think I can kill him here. Ah, never mind. You actually backing? Or are you baiting me again? No, you actually backed. Grab the chalice. It seems weird. My color, my color scheme on my monitor seems a bit dim. I did upgrade my, not upgrade. I uh, updated my graphics driver. It seems weird that updating your driver would lower the color scaling. Oh, hello. That scared the bejesus out of me. I am winning this, by the way. Oh. Okay then. No, no cooldown. All right. Nice. That's a big help for me. Oh, you're not. You're not coming back in on this, right? Um. Oh, you're just dead. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Perfect. Let's go. That's actually really hard to kill him, man. He's so wiggly. He is so incredibly wiggly. All right. He did go Berserker Shield. We all knew he would. Nothing new there. I think I'm going to max my one and my two and ignore. Oh, you know what? Regrowth would actually be pretty nice here. I'm going to go regrowth hydras. This is not something I would normally ever do, but I do heal with my three and my two. Getting the extra move speed would actually be really nice. I'm going to, I'm going to try this and we'll see how it works out. I don't think he's doing bull demon. Oh, he's. I just heard his three stop. Oh, I accidentally stepped in my puddle and became Sonic. You better back up, Bozo. Big healing. It actually heals me a crap ton. I think I'm just gonna go for him. Oh my god. <laughs> he just got slapped mid charge up. That's so funny. Um, all right. Heal off the melees. There's not really much I can do here. Unfortunately, he cleared my wave, so. I'll try to do some tower damage, but I don't have any attacks. Dude. Oh, you're actually backing. Yeah, I'm not doing, like, much damage at all. 
he also is doing nothing at all. The difference is I, I heal quite a bit more than he does. So even though we're like neither of us are doing anything, I am eventually poking him down. His red is, or I'm sorry, his blue is spawning. He is waiting for it. Hello? Dude, is it not insane how much I heal? Oh. Oh, okay. All right. I don't get the kill, but I do get the tower. Maybe I don't get the tower. Oh, if my one hit. Oh. He had his, his horn shard. His good old horny was available. I should not have done that. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Clear the wave. No, they didn't kill. Get him, Melees. Get him. I can't see. Oh. Wow, I had a lot of gold. Why did I have so much gold in hand? Let's go beat stick. And let's go Blink. I feel like Blink's going to be really helpful. He's surviving with like no HP. Not bad. After this game, before I queue up my next one though, I would really love to change my, my scaling, my color grading back to normal. Because it seems so dim. Oh, you do that and lose your tower, I guess. I'll take it. Dude, that Hydra has just slapped the bejesus out of this guy. Oh my goodness. Um... I don't even know if I can confirm this. Never mind. I guess he assumed I wasn't going to actually do it because he was like in the middle of the lane. It's a fair assumption, to be honest. It's kind of a weird play by me to actually fully commit. But I, the reason I fully committed was because it seemed like a weird play. Well, I missed. He's just not going to care. He plays so odd, man. He's so hyper aggressive in some scenarios when he shouldn't be. And so passive in scenarios where he should be hyper aggressive. Yeah, like, look at that. If he was gonna just farm and get my wave and stuff, why didn't he just farm and get my wave and stuff? I, he just... He got blue buff and came back to watch me take his phoenix. There's a whole wave he could have killed. And another blue buff he could have gotten. I'm feeling good here. There's his horrific. All right. Relic down. I have 3000 gold again. I don't really know how. I feel like I'm getting gold so much faster than I normally do. And it's kind of freaking me out. All right. Let's see if my blue is up so I can refresh my passive. He got a 500 pop for defense, so he knows what he's doing. 
By the way, I recommend if you uh if you're at a life or death scenario in your game, you should just buy a 500 pot. That hit me. Oh, minions are OP. Popping all the potions. Nice. Oh, I thought I had my ult up. What am I doing? What am I doing? I blinked in assuming I could ult out. And I couldn't. What is wrong with me? I have no idea. Let's go to my NVIDIA settings. I would like... My digital vibrance. Oh, it's not changing. It's not changing my smite game. Weird. Uh, it kind of is. Is it the brightness I want to go up? Maybe. I increase the brightness a little bit. Not that it matters. Oh, he was right there. All right. So it's going to just come down to me. Well, re-getting this Phoenix obviously is a big thing. But I think it's a poke fight for me. It's it's not an all-in. For him, it is an all-in. I should have tried to jump that. I did try to jump it, but... Okay. That should keep him slow. And then I can lifesteal off of this stuff. And then... Oh, ouch. He's not going to back because I'm, I'm acting like I'm going to backdoor it. I have so much healing. Oh, that missing the twos. Honestly, tragic for me. I'm going to heal off this. These minions, in case you're wondering what I'm doing. Alright, good ult. Good ult. Ow, I didn't think it was still charging. don't get it. Why am I doing no damage to him? Is his healing actually that much to where beat stick isn't doing enough? He doesn't have any lifesteal. He's going hard seeker. Your middle tower is under attack. Hmm. Your middle tower has been destroyed. I kind of want to go serrated here. Damn. Your middle Phoenix is under attack. What's my cooldown at? My cooldown is capped. I don't need to pick up blue buff. I'm gonna go get a 500 pot. I don't know. I feel my cooldowns are very long. My jump is nine seconds. 
It is kind of long. I do only have 300 power. I don't know. Okay, that did 700 damage to me. Okay, he did it again. I'm telling my mommy. Okay, never mind. Jesus Christ, dude. does have red buff. Oh, I missed. I really thought he was going to juke back hard. Dude, he is actually dealing so much damage to me. And he's healing a lot too, because I'm like, I'm pumping a lot of numbies into him. Yeah, that's, that's nearly, what is that? Nearly 3,500. He, I mean, he did a lot to me too, but. Jesus. I don't know. I don't know. He probably has a 3k pot now because he's been saving for a bit. Oh no, because he just finished Heartseeker. So actually he doesn't have a 3k pot yet. But I cannot for the life of me win a fight. He doesn't have red buff on now. I assume he wants. Oh, thank God. Thank God. I really was scared I was going to lose this game. Game one. Could you imagine? I really don't understand how I was losing most of the fights. I mean, normally the person with Hydras is just out trading. The Titans is a bad pickup because it's not like I have that much defense. I literally only have Breastplate. And yet he still was out trading me. Like he had a, a suboptimal build to, to play against mine, but he was still just slapping me. My God, man. My God. All right, I'll see you guys in game two. Welcome back to assassins the movie um we already played Kamazots. i want to play bastet obviously at some point i want to play bakasura um there's so many there is so many assassins to choose from honestly there's so many of them i wonder if i did a video of every assassin in duel how long that video would be one two three four five six seven eight that's 24 games of duel i'd have to play that would take probably about nine hours. Same for guardians, same for hunters, much longer for mages and a little bit shorter for warriors. Bro, there's so many gods in this game. <laughs> there's so many. It's like, uh, the, okay, you've got to start vaulting some shit. Like putting some some gods away that cannot be played because I'm I promise to you that it's it's too damn much. I'm fighting Rakudo Breka. I don't know why I rolled my arms. Right. This ben ben is ready to kick some butt. Kick 
some butt. <laughs> I don't know, man. I don't know. If you ask me why I do the things I do, I, I will, I'll never be able to tell you. I also almost just bought a meditation unironically against an outwash. Like I said, I haven't played Smite in a long time. The uh, video yesterday or two days ago, I don't, I'm not sure when I recorded it, uh, but <clears throat> that video is my first game back. That, that Kamazots game was my second game of Smite since I moved. Which, by the way, um, I did move. I moved houses. We 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 got one. I'm no long, longer renting, so that's pretty sick. Oh man, that's kind of unfortunate. But oh well. Okay, I'm dead. Yes, how Posh knows everything there is to know about being the best. I have no mana. He's just going to go tablet on me. Oh, I'm so dead. Just get the wave. Just get the wave. Alright, we got the wave. Honestly, that was deserved. That was deserved. I have no mana sustain, and I wanted to make him have no mana sustain. It backfired. This is going to be an extremely difficult game for me. For reasons I don't really have to say. But I will, because I know some people are just starting out. Um... Outpwash is a king of poke, and I am a poke god, so he's going to do what I do, just better than me, unfortunately. Also, Tablet of Destinies is OP broken. Can you guys group up, please? No, that's unfortunate. I really just want the XP here. He's acting like he has tablet because he's trying to poke, but he definitely does not have tablet. Yet. Oh, that's really good. I blocked his uh, his wave clear. And his name is John Cena. You can't reach me. I'm terrified. Alright. So he's going tablet. I'm going trans. Mm. He has 50% anti-heal built into his kit. Which means I probably shouldn't go soul leader. Although I'm not saying it's going to stop me. Yeah, he's going to be stacking that tablet really fast. That tablet is going to be an absolute travesty for me to deal with. Oh, is this blue already back up? Interesting. Yep, yep. He really just wants to stack tablet on me, man. Mm, I am curious on if I can kill him, maybe. Oh, he stepped up. The damage. Oh, tablet. Ouch. 
Okay. Oh, I am just dead. Interesting. Interesting. I'm not going to die doing blue buff, right? He doesn't have a ton of mana. He does have a blue buff, but, uh, you know. Maybe it's fine. I'm terrified. Alright, let's go Pestilence first, because I... I am going to go Beat Stick and Pestilence. Obviously, I'm going to combine them. But, um... I would much rather have some sort of survival than extra damage at the moment. Okay. He, got a, he only got one stack of Tablet on me there. Because they hit so, uh... So close to each other. My main thing right now is... Making sure he's not, like, giga stacking tablet. Like, when I played that out wash game on YouTube a while ago, I had, like, 25 stacks on my tablet already. Yeah, this is my this is my main issue. How much sustain he has. And he's going regrowth too. Which obviously does not help my issue. That's good stuff. Oh, that's not great. Um, alright, let's just go get pestilence now. There's nothing up right now, and Pestilence is going to give me, what is it, 65% anti-heal? Yeah, 65, so... It's going to be good enough. Actually, no, it's 55. I should not have walked into that. Stupid and dumb. Hmm... Oh, man. Well, his blue buff is definitely up. I lied. Obviously. Am I lagging? Why did my three go that way? He's got so many tablet stacks on me at this point. Um, I just have to give him red buff, I think. Yeah, I'm gonna just give him red. Plus, I mean, to be honest with you, I need cooldown anyways. Blue's not even bad for me. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, whatever. Stack your tablet, bozo. There's nothing I can do against it. I just got to farm. Okay. That was good for me. Is beat stick 25? That was close. All right, this wave will give me beat stick. 
which will put me in the advantageous situation rather than the the big old fat loser situation because now now that i'm not a fat loser i think that i just out damage him because he gets no healing anymore I think he wants that that blue buff really bad. Alright. That is as expected. We got his horn shard. Now I do have a little bit of healing, so it's not all bad if I do some poking. Still gone. We're actually relatively even now. In terms of gold. I mean, he's still ahead a little bit. But not by that much. Ow. That tablet does hurt me, man. You do not have the abilities to fight me at the moment, sir. He's going to alt that and he's going to be mad because he lost his red buff and with that fight lost his advantage of the entire game. That fight actually made this game start going in my, my direction here. I am now ahead in gold and experience. Um, I want a serrated cause that's going to do a lot of damage to me. I'm thinking my relic choice is going to be a, a horrific, but I want to make sure he doesn't go sprint first. I don't know why he's fake back. Excuse me. I burped. Should I just go for it and do Bull Demon? What are the odds he knows I'm doing this? Because he was backing. There's no way, right? And then I'm going to make a super dumb play and I'm going to go Thorns here. Now the reason Thorns is dumb... Is, well, okay, it's not actually that stupid because Thorns does magical damage. He doesn't have magical defense, so it's not like I'm... It's not like I'm breaking rules that, you know, are set by the smite gods themselves. I'm just... It's not as good of a relic as it could be if I waited to counterpick. Okay, well... Yeah, we get it, bro. You're stacking tablet. Okay, my thorns. Yeah, see, my thorns only did 200 damage. That's not like game changing or anything. It's just a little nice. Where I, I feel like if I waited and went like sprint or horrific or something, those relics could have been game changing, which is why I don't like going thorns, but you know, I don't know. Maybe at some point, maybe it will be out divine. 
I have no idea where my cat went. He's giving me red? Okay, that's weird. That is weird. I'm going Hydras because it gives me another 10% pen. And, I mean, cooldown. I only have 10% cooldown right now. I can... Hmm. Oh, okay, he's better than I am. Oh my god, I do so much damage. Yeah, I do. I do so much damage. That Hydra's... My god. That Hydra's does so much, man. Alright, throw the cat in there. Group up the minions. Use my two. And Hydra's auto. Dude. I'm doing so much damage. I just wanted to get my two on the Titan. A little extra. Quick numby pumping, you know? I don't want him to get this blue buff. He only has 20% cooldown, which is really bad. But he is going Chrono Spending right now, so. So he should have max cooldown now. Um. Yeah, he's max cooldown. I don't know. I kind of want to just save and go into a Crusher here. I don't know if it's the right play or not. I don't know. I am 2,000 gold ahead, so I feel like there's no way it's the wrong play, right? Your middle under oh, man. Oh, that hit me. Tablet does a lot of damage to me. Ouch. I missed. Oh, well, let's get his beads here. Never mind, I'm garbage. I mean. Oh, we got his ult. Gotta count for something, right? Actually, we're out trading him really, really well. He has max cooldown, but... He can't really do much to me. If I hit my ult, by the way, he'd, he'd be dead and I would've won the game already. Okay. Ow, I really thought he was backing. That was kind of rude. I'm going to full commit Bull Demon here. Mainly because... I don't think he'll expect it. And also... His Phoenix is spawning soon. I will grab this. And we will grab... I mean, there's literally no reason to ever go regrowth or overgrowth. You get a little more movement speed and attack speed, but that's like only for conquest. In duel, you buy that and you get 5% more attack speed and movement speed, or you don't buy it, you buy the other one and you get like a significant reduction in your, in your cooldown. Ow. 
าวโอ้ there we go you know what thorns actually did a lot there thorns did 400 for me there that is not something I'm I'm willing to overlook I think thorns was a good play I take it back thorns I think you might actually have been been a solid pickup for me it was not a good pickup for him though one he used it too late but two I have magical defense and thorns is magical damage so you never build if you are a character that does magical damage you never buy thorns ever just like as a rule of thumb if you're a magical damage character do not buy that gg you know i've gotten plus 16 both games instead of plus 15 which is so weird I don't know. I'll see you guys in game three. Hello, boys. Welcome to game number three. So far, we have done Kamazots and Bastet. We're going over to the Fenrir. I could have done the cleanup, but, you know, I feel like Fenrir is a bit banned. Like, a lot of people ban him pretty often, so... Oh, it's a Fenrir mirror. By the way, I only have a gold border on Fenrir. Um, because I was trying to recreate for a long time, for probably three months. Um... I've been trying to recreate the no item Fenrir game. And that means about, mm, I don't know, about five, five times a day. Sometimes it's like three, sometimes it's like eight, you know, sometimes I'll do a ton of attempts, but on average, I'd say about five attempts a day for the past months on end, <laughs> I have been really trying to do that video and it's backfired so much that uh it's backfired so much that i have a gold finner board but i mean it's just gonna make him feel overconfident and i'm gonna win so i'm cool with it what's your build Hmm. Oh, get him. What the? Oh, no, no. No, what? Bro. My three. My three hit the minion instead of him, and then I just got railed because of it. Oh my god. Nothing more tragic in my life has ever happened. That is upsetting. That is so, 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 so upsetting. I can't believe it. I'm pathetic. Right, he's not level five yet, thankfully. So what are you doing? What are you doing? There are so many things you could have done and you did that. You know what? I'm not going to be mad. Thank you for your service. I'm going to go... I'm going to go with Dominance. I want more of an immediate power spike over a stacking power spike. The 15% attack speed, the extra 20 power initially. It's going to be fine. Though I will say, Transcendence is good. So if he goes the transcendence route, I better get really far ahead really quickly.
All right, I'm not idiotic, so I'm not going to fight him. He went Dominus too. Okay. But I'm not idiotic, so I'm not going to fight him under his tower. Do you have your jump up? Oh. Okay. Okay, you got to be so careful, my dude. Hmm. This isn't even up yet. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, that was kind of terrifying. He knows I don't have beads, so he has, he's playing me. Like, he's trying to bait me into that tower really hard. I mean, you can tell how hard because of the way he literally just played that fight, but... He's not really respecting my damage. No, because we are the same character, but, uh... I'm just straight up two levels ahead. You really can't fight me. That's not good. I die here, I think. Oh, wait. Maybe not. I'm so dead. Not dead? Okay. That was a mistake. Get him. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> hmm. All right. A little terrifying. A little terrifying. He's going Berserker Shield. I'm going Hydra's. My power spike is going to be incredibly high. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if he can finish his Hydra's or not. Or I'm sorry, his, his Berserker's. Berserker's is quite a bit more expensive than Hydra's, correct? Berserker's. Yeah, uh, it's only 100 gold more, actually. So he could probably finish it. Well, he couldn't. Yes. Yes. Good damage. Oh, shit. My three went off, but it didn't actually go off. Like the cooldown of my three. I knew he was going to alt it, right? But I thought that I could three away. Three far enough away to where I would win the fight because he couldn't bring me into tower. Um, and my three went off, but he, it didn't matter. Apparently. Unlucky. Unlucky. Also, why am I leveling my three instead of my two? Feeds down. Hmm. 
I really want to see if I can kill him, but... I don't know. Probably not worth the attempt. I'm only 500 gold ahead. 500 gold is not really a lot. That Berserker Shield is absolutely carrying, by the way. I feel like we're doing the same amount of damage to each other, even when I'm Hydra's autoing him. Just because Berserker Shield gives you straight up mitigation, you know? Okay, I just slapped the bejesus out of him. Alright. I'm feeling good here. Obviously, I'm going to jump on him. He's going to ult. Now you die. Okay. Okay. He doesn't die, but he definitely, uh, definitely doesn't look like he's living too well. You know what I mean? And I can get my beads, by the way, but I'm a thousand gold ahead, so I kind of don't want to. I just want to put pressure on him. The extra attack speed is good. I don't know. Beads would probably be decent. I mean, I easily won that trade. Not actually, he actually back there? Just give me the free red. Okay. Wonder why. I really thought he was going to fight me. That's that's why I met it. And this guy plays the most passive Fenrir. Did... What the heck was that? What the heck was that? He just walked up to me. I pop wing blade. He either needs to run away when I pop wing shard or die. And he just stood there and died. Why? I don't know. But I guess I'll see you guys in the next game. I'm going to open my shades a little bit. It's dark out, so it won't matter anymore. All right. See you guys next game. Welcome back, boys. This game, we're going to be playing the good old fashion. Mm, let's see. What do I want to play? Mm. Could play Robin, could play Sukiyomi. What assassin has a good early game? Thanatos? I don't want to play Thanatos. That god scares the bejesus out of me. Let's just go Robin. Let's just go Robin. I'm watching my good friend Trelly Relly right now on his Twitch stream. 
which by the way, like I said, uh, I am going to be going live. I'm still doing a lot of stuff for the house. So I don't know how often I'll be live this week. Just kind of, if you want to see me live on Twitch, just follow the channel. We're trying to get to a hundred thousand uh, followers anyways. So you can do that. But on top of that, if you don't want to just follow the channel and wait and, and watch out, you can just go to my channel on Monday. Cause on Monday, let me see Monday, the 20th, my schedule is going to start back up 12 to six every single day. And I might be doing 12 hour streams. I'm not sure. I'm really not sure. I'm going to go horrific here. Horrific and horn shard. And I don't think Robin is very mana hungry. So we're going to get one in each ability. And then I think we're just going to try to fucking brawl, dude. My goal is to get him to low HP and then run away so he doesn't heal off me with his passive. Minions have spawned. Is he starting blue buff? He is. Well, that is weird. My one did nothing to him. Also, my three does my most damage. Wow, I literally never would have guessed that. Almost. Mm. Ow. Oh, there's his passive. But he's not able to utilize it, which is great for me. How much damage does this do? Hmm. It should be okay here, correct? Okay, never mind. Dude, I'm losing every engagement. Well, I'm not really losing this one. I just am not winning it. You can tell how bad I am at this game right now. Like how absolutely disgustingly, terribly fucking horrible I am at ru and like, and rusty and just disgusting. I am playing so incredibly poor. Hmm. I'm just gonna run. Figured as much. I guess we both just grab Transcendence here. My question is... Does he go Soul Eater? My initial thought is, of course, he's Pele. He just took a lot of damage. Let's see if I can get this. The whole reason I dove and pushed him out was so I could get it. Worked out. Very nice. He is going Soul Eater. So 
I wonder if I should just go breastplate next item. I honestly could go uh, breastplate of regrowth because I do have my three, which is a heal. Oh my god, ouch. Oh, I'm dead. Okay. Okay. Mm. If I hit that three, he was just dead. And I missed the three and I'm just dead. And then, and, and I don't know why. I don't know why I keep playing these risky garbage plays. Like, I, I see how fucking terrible I am. Like I witness it and I keep doing it. Nothing is more upsetting to me than being bad at my job. And uh, honestly, right now, I've never seen anyone worse. This is tragic. He's going Soul Eater. Thankfully, Soul Eater takes some time to build up. I'm just hoping that during that build up time, I, uh, I do enough to where it's okay. Like I, I farm enough to where I can get some anti heal online for it. Hmm. Wonder why he wouldn't alt. I think the reason he wouldn't alt is because I have my alt, but that doesn't seem like too great of an idea because I mean, if you, if you don't alt, you die, right? So I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. I do have my berserkers. He is getting his blue buff, unfortunately, but... It's okay. Baited him into a fight. He took it. He died. That's exactly what I needed. And this red buff should be spawning pretty soon. He doesn't have alt. He doesn't have blink. Nothing like that. Oh, he might have blink. He is level 12, actually. Uh, no, he got sprint. Good. Right now we go beat stick because the soul eater. I should be able to get my soul eater online by the time, or I'm sorry, my beat stick online by the time uh, I need to counter his soul eater. Oh, he's doing his blue buff. Bummer. Now your blue buff is down. That's down. Ooh. 
really don't want to fight me, right? Circling around, man. Oh, man. Nothing makes me hate the way this guy plays. Other than everything. Dude, how do I miss that three? Oh. I'm so I'm so mad, dude. I'm so fucking mad. All right. Right. I can turn that down one notch. Okay. I'm, dude, I'm playing like absolute dog shit. Like, I. Both going serrated now. He already got it, bro. What the? F He's a hundred gold ahead. How is he that far? Oh my god. He's 100 gold ahead and also seemingly 2,000 gold ahead of me. He's not going to do Bull Demon while my, while my Titan has that little HP, so I don't need to worry about Bull Demon right now. And if he does, then I don't care. Is double lifesteal and a healing passive. I feel like I should go Toxic Blade. I did win that fight. I wonder if he's 
Oh, I was going to say whenever he's going to go Bull Demon, but... Like I said, I wouldn't really care if he did. Mm. Well, he's going Toxic Blade too? That is a bad decision. I don't know why he would. I'm not healing very much. I don't have a healing passive, and I'm only one lifesteal item, not two. So... I don't think he needs it. But I guess if he thinks he needs it. I haven't found the treasure chest all game, by the way. Why am I so bad? Bro, how do you already have it, though, actually? How do you, how do I see you right here? Check your build. You have tier two toxic. I come back. I don't know. I don't fucking know. This might is such a dog shit game, bro. Can't even kill him. I don't know why I'm running at him. Oh, man. Defense again with mid guardian. How does that miss? Guard doesn't really bother me. It's not gonna do too much to me. It's Is he just getting bold even? Oh, he sold it for an XE. Okay. Solid construction. Excellent choice. I feel like a kins would do more. He backed. I guess for a 500 pot. He 
wants to win game here. Sprinted. Sprinted with his three up. I can't catch him. Um. He's backing there. I would love if I could get that red, but I don't think I win the fight. I think I have to stay under tower here. Or Titan. Technically not tower. I do want to upgrade to, to this one. I don't know if it will matter because it's 50 seconds on the cooldown, but maybe. I can do a lot more damage with this Kins. Alright. He really didn't do that much damage. It's actually, actually really good for me because no, I don't know. I guess he could back door, but I have horrific up. We won't have alts up. I don't think either of us will. And I'll have a big old shield right now. Thanks to my passive to hopefully fight him. Or keep him away from my Titan. At least a little bit. idea where he went. He juked backwards because he assumed that I was going to uh, alt over the wall. But I assumed that he would assume that I would alt over the wall. So I didn't alt over the wall. So we killed him. I think I can get Phoenix here. I definitely can get Phoenix. I'm gonna drop red buff just so he can't get it. And then I always oh, getting a kins too. 
He sees how much Kins is doing. What did he sell for that? I was soul leader. I can sell my toxic blade then. Probably. He was just backing. minions unlucky I don't want to die I did just use both my relics though and now he has entangling that's pretty terrifying honestly um, I'm still gonna pick this up I still like the cooldown I think I don't want to do bull demon, but I don't know if I feel like he'll come over here and just beat my ass. No. Is he waiting for red buff? I would prefer him not getting red buff either. I have to play so scared, I feel like. Because while, yes, I'm currently winning, it's just one fight. One fight is all it takes to throw this game. Oh. My two did that much damage, huh? Oh, man. That game should not have even been hard. Oh. I wish I was better at this game, man. I'll see you next game. Okay, I'm back. Um, the mental has been restored, thankfully. Let us do Kali. Right oh, Merlin. A little Murray. A little Merlin. I should be able to one-hit him. I think. If I go... Oh, well, I mean, it's going to be really hard because I have to get to late game. But if I if I do get to late game... Hold on, sorry, I'm thinking. Um, no, Blink will be my second relic. My first relic will just be a shell, I think. And then we'll go... I could go Horn Shard for more damage, but I think I'm going to go Claw Shard for the healing. Um, I... am going to... do something, but I can't remember. Hold on. Let me think, let me think, let me think. Oh. Oh. I was going to say, I did attempt a Kali game that was cut out because I accidentally kicked my GoXLR mic. 
for my Go XLR mixer. And I all the audio got cut out of that game. Like my mic wasn't being picked up and my I don't know if this is going to work by the way. My mic wasn't being picked up and the game sound was gone and it was just a terrible experience. So, you know, I, and I was fighting in Ao Kong, which is a terrible matchup for Kali. So, I got dumped on and then I decided, well, unlucky. And so I'm cutting that Kali game out and instead I'm doing this one. Hopefully I don't accidentally get mad and kick my mixer again. That would be unfortunate. Oh, I didn't get mad last time. I actually just kicked it on accident. But Now my foot is on my chair. So I'm pogged out of my mind. All right. We got a clear Daddy McGee over here. All he cares about is clearing, clearing wave and bitches. So. The mental is restored from last game, by the way. Hello. Ow. Boom. Oh. That actually chunked. That did a lot of damage. Hello. I kind of want to go Dominance, but I do think that going Hydras is better. Or, I'm sorry, Transcendence Hydras. Good old combo. The good old Wombo combo. There's nothing I can do to him. I'm just... I just gotta let him get his... Get his little bookie. While I chill here. Now I can go get my trans. Sometimes the best defense is a good offense. Oh, he actually went Book of Thought instead of Tablet. I kind of thought he would go Tablet. I mean, I know he's going to go Tablet, but I thought he would go Tablet first. You jump, you blink, I clear. Easy. There's like literally nothing on the map for me to do. I'm not killing a Merlin under his tower, and he's not killing a Kali level 5, so... I guess I'll just go over here and clear. <laughs> oh man that is so unlucky for him we both took our shot only mine actually hit that's unlucky actually i think his one did hit it just didn't kill i was still kind of uh like i was more healthy than he was i'm not gonna go for his blue I think I get dumpy on. I want to clear the wave. Don't hit me. All right, he is building the tablet, tablet like I expected. Oh man. Oh man. Damn it. Ow, damn it. He's playing me. I'm a I'm a fiddle right now. Ow. 
Damn it. Does he have a ward there? Oh, shit. No! Oh, shit. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm a bit rough. Ah! <laughs> Don't do it. <laughs> okay nice nice i think i'm actually gonna go rage and then i'll go hydras i know i have no defense but uh 30 percent crit chance and it also gives you power when you get stacks so it's good to get that item online early you do be having that tablet online No idea where my little Merlin be. Ah, poopy. Or poppycock, as they say in the olden times. Is your blue up? Tis. Nice. Nice. And I picked up the blue buff. I used my auto. I used my alt to, to be an auto attack reset. And I'm sure I don't have to mention how to do that because I've said it so many times on this channel. Nice. So now my rage is a 40 power, 37 and a half crit chance item. That's not bad. Not bad. And I can get that. Obviously, I'm going to go blink. Um, I do kind of want to stay in my... My fountain for Hydras, but... There is a wave pushing. Sometimes the best defense... All right, let's see. He's going to Magi's. It stops my stun once. Oh my gosh. I had a 500 damage crit there. Just like that. 487. I think that was a Hydra's crit. Because I don't have that much power to do 500 damage crits already. That was definitely a, uh, a Hydra's proc. You do be having a tablet. Ow. Uh, I kind of just want to go Deathbringer next item. But I also don't want him to get that blue buff. Also, my hair is in my ear. You. 530 damage, bro. You do a lot, man. Do 
650. Jeepers. How much is Deathbringer? 2,900. Honestly, not very nice. Hello. It did hit him. Oof. I don't think I can get Phoenix with this. They're all kind of fucked up already. Oh, no, I definitely can. Cool. All right, let's back. And then we'll go crit chance, Deathbringer, and then upgrade to that one. Grab a chalice. My crit chance is now 60. Oh, it's 73%. It's 65 if you don't have any stacks. But I have three. Okay, that was a thousand damage. This doesn't seem like a very good matchup for him, does it? Because I am knock-up immune in my alt. Hello. Ow. Should I go for the kill, though? I feel like I should go for the kill. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Three auto attacks for 1,700 damage. And it happened so fast, he couldn't even react. Because it happened all on my stun. Oh my god. Not to mention the extra 400 damage my 2 did. Yike Ruskies. Alright, see you guys next game. Jesus. What's up, boys? I'm back. Oh my god, he has a diamond. He has a Masterborn of Nike? What the heck? It's Kashi again? I'm just sessioning Kashi right now. I'm just sessioning him, dude. This is my third game, fourth game. Alright, uh, I kind of want to go straight Soul Eater. But it has no power. And it lets him get anti here really quick. I'm just going to do trans. Scrooge it, man. Why not? Do that. Let's do... Let's do Claw Shard. And then I want to put two points in my three, one point in my one. Just so... Just so I can clear, right? Does that even clear? Let's see, because putting a point in my two gives me 70 damage. Putting another point in my three gives... Ouch. Gives me 25 plus 50. Plus the scalings. So it actually is more damage to put two points in your three. You paused? You paused on me? I'm waiting? Am I knock up immune in my one? While channeling this scream, Kleena is immune to knock ups. Okay, cool. So her one doesn't matter. Or not her one, I'm sorry, her three. Well, it still does damage. It still got buff damage. Wonder why he paused. Let's go. I want to learn TFT again. I was, uh, what was I? I got to masters in TFT. It was, it was apex that I only got to diamond one. 
But I did get Masters in TFT. But it's been so long. Um. Yo, he do be auto attacking. I don't know why he did that. Because now he can't clear. Okay, or maybe I can't clear. Alright. We got his horny shard. You getting the minis? He was getting the minis. I'm pretty healthy still, man. Please. I thought he would juke into it. Because he didn't juke into my ult, it looks like a bad play, but I promise you, if he juked into it, it would have looked insane. I'm dead as shit, by the way. Please don't touch me. Because he has an ult. Oh, no. The wall. <laughs> oh. I lived. He has no mana. Let's freaking go, dude. <clears throat> and I can clear these because they only do four damage per hit. Which means I can get my transcendence. Oh, and I can clear the wave. Because I have an ultimate. Perfect. <laughs> I grab that. Um, do I? Here's the thing. Do I go breastplate? Or do I not go breastplate? Because I'm thinking there's two things, right? I'm thinking I could just go soul eater. You know, 10% cooldown. Good damage, good survivability a little bit later in the game. Or I could go Breastplate. Hey. So he clears... Pre ah! Ah! I did not think he had alt up again. Genuinely didn't think he'd have alt up. I don't know why. Well, I, okay, I do know why I thought that. It's because I can't keep track of timers when my alt is on a 30 second timer because I have two ticks of it. I'm just small brained. That's the honest answer, mine. Um, That's the complete and honest truth. I actually just don't know how to keep track of timers when I don't have any. Um, you think he kills me here? I actually did a lot of damage. Bonk. Ow. 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 Jesus Christ. Oh my God. That was close. Hmm. Okay. Turns out I underestimate Nike's damage quite a bit. Or I underestimate. 
not underestimated. I just straight up did underestimate. Oh, by the way, Scar is playing in the background. So, uh, oops. It was muted, but still, oops. Hmm. There's nowhere where I can get cool stuff. Or whatever. Let's go get my soul leader and then do blue. I think I have to AFK for a bit. I'm 500 gold down and I'm going to lose. I'm going to lose this game if I keep trying to fight. Especially double stacking against somebody with a berserker shield. Oh, glad shield. Whatever. Same thing. Hello. I want to be by him when he clears my wave like that because soul eater. Okay. Damn it. Just go breastplate here. I know that going breastplate is going to cap me out on cooldown instantly. So like blue buffs or 500 pots are going to be useless, but I think capping out on cooldown is important. I just want to be close enough to get the XP or not the XP. You know what I mean? The soul leader stacks. Ow. Man, he does a lot of damage. I wonder if he is actually going to go bull demon here. Oh, he's not. Hello. Hello. He has a thousand gold ahead of me. That's a lot. Did, are you doing this blue? Ah, damn. Wonder if he has this red buff. Because he doesn't have a buff on him right now. Which makes me want to think. Oh, one of the buffs is up. Oh, this one is spawning now. Okay. See if we can get it. Nice. I still don't have stacks on my soul leader yet. It's going to be a while. At best, I can get 12 stacks per wave. So, like, it's going to be a long freaking time. You know, even though I was the person who last hit every single one of those, I only got four stacks. Okay. I tried to dash, but I got knocked back from his three and it didn't let me. Ow. Jesus Christ, dude. How rude can one person be? That's another instance where I had... I cleared the whole wave. I needed six stacks in order to get my soul leader finished and it only gave me four or five. All right, soul leader finished. Pog. All right. Honestly, not bad damage. Oh, 
I wonder if he's chasing me. Oh, I'm dead. Damn. He actually did catch me with that. I can't believe he caught me with that. Well played. Um, he has very strong power spike items, you know? And I have items that need additional items to be actually good. I kind of just want to go straight Heartseeker here. Especially because Heartseeker is going to give me a lot of mana. I, I like Crusher does the same thing Heartseeker does. Not a little bit better, but... Um, but it doesn't actually give you too much additional because the mana you get from Heartseeker is pretty good. It's pretty important. Man, I would love this red buff, but there's no way in hell I'm getting it. Ah, oh, dicks. Oh. Perfect. Perfect. Dude, getting Soul Eater is so big. Like, you just lose the game until it's finished. But then once your Soul Eater is finished and you can actually, like, like it's fully stacked, it feels very, very good. It always feels so bad building Soul Eater until it feels good. You know what I mean? <laughs> going Crusher and then Erendite, I assume. Did I get the wave? I did, right? Alright. Um, Alright, let's go that and then we'll go Crusher. Second Relic, I actually don't know what I want yet. I think I want to sprint. Because when he ults and I can't move, it feels not great. I wonder if he's going to go check Bull Demon. Oh, hello. Am I dead here? Oh, shit. So close. That was so close because I was pretty sure I was dead there. I don't think that I can kill his Titan. I only have 900 health. I could maybe do like 2000 damage to it. But I'd also risk dying and I probably wouldn't get red buff if I did that. So I'd much rather get red buff not risk dying uh grab crusher here want to grab sprint here 
And then I want to grab, I guess, Feet Stick. Feet Stick does make some sense. It's crazy I was 0 3 this game. Double stacking is crazy ineffective early, especially when your opponent like utilizes the early game by going dominance over trans and going like a cheap uh, defensive item. Like you get so far ahead doing that. It's a good strategy. Oh my god. GG. GG. Yo, my alts did so much damage. I think I hit both alts. Because it did a thousand damage. I just like X marks the spot on the Titan. And in order to get close to me, you had to walk through him. Alright, I'll see you guys in the next game and probably the final game. Alright, boys. Welcome to the last and probably final game of this video. I've been recording forever. I've been recording for actually ever three and a half hours. By the time this game ends, it'll probably be about three hours and 40 minutes. So I'm hoping taking out queue times and my smite crashing because of my go XLR and you know, uh, doing other stuff i'm hoping that it is at least a two hour long video it could be a little bit longer honestly or it could be a little bit shorter but overall i'm happy as long as it's around the, th the two hour mark um i'll go wing shard why not I feel like I shouldn't use my two. Actually, that's not true. What I should do is be cheeky as hell. Run back here, throw the three so they have to run through it. Okay, hey, that scared the bejesus fucking poop out of me. You absolute demon. No. Okay. Holy crap. Bro, I just wanted to to sneak the wave clear, man. Like <laughs> All of a sudden I'm in an all out brawl for my life. My goodness. Please do not. I, w I really want to get his blue buff, but I feel like I can't. Because I feel like there's no way that I would ever be allowed to out secure him. Hello. Oh, I did it. Dicks. Ow. Those nine auto attacks are from his little thingy, right? Not actually him. That's crazy. That has so much damage. Damn, dude. I should have respected the damage a bit more. Oh, well. gonna be an annoying game to win i think i can win it it's just like i said gonna be annoying because i can't really get close to him god damn that actually does so much damage using your one like that early game 
a lot. He's just spamming it too. He's gonna be a bit a bit ahead of me. That's okay though. I don't mind. I don't mind. I think later in the game, when my ones are doing like four hundred damage, it's gonna be fine. Because right now it's really hard to compete with him. Ouch. And he's got the Aegis for my alt, so. We're just in a waiting game. Mm. That was pretty good. That is pretty good for me. I got his Aegis. And I didn't lose too much HP at all. See, I would love to get this blue buff. Oh, that is so obnoxious. Oh my god. Okay. Okay. My mistake. I didn't think he would do that much damage. Man. My calculations are terrible. Babe, can you hear me? I was it in How did you know I was talking about my fart swallower account? I don't think she can hear me. I think her and Yas are talking. And my fart swallower account just came up because Yas is probably playing Smite. achieved so any kind of soul gem shenanigans aren't going to be that good for him and his three actually ticks damage so it pretty much guarantees he has forever maximum stacks which is really nice for me thinking maybe hydra's next item Does no damage at all to him. He's going poly. Mm, decent damage. Oh. 
he seems so confused on what to go for here. I missed everything. Okay. Jesus Christ. Oh, I'm just dead. Yeah, I'm just dead. Damn, man. I do no damage. Eight auto attacks for 380. That's really bad. It is really low on the damage output. Please tell me he did not steal my blue buff. He didn't. Okay. Another thing is I literally can never get my two off in this matchup. Because he has the one fear, the two knockback, and the alt CC immunity. So I have literally no options for a stun. So I'm just missing an entire margin of my kit. Like a huge piece of my kit. Got poly arts too. Ouchies. Do not do enough damage for him to be scared. I want to go Hydra Serrated here. Is your blue up? No, not yet. I go that, and I guess we'll go beads, because maybe you can beads while channeling abilities, so I can use my two and beads when I need it. Maybe I'll be able to get a stun off. Hmm. Ouch. Whatever. If you're going to be annoying, I'll be annoying. I'll take your tower one auto attack at a time, brother. It's actually doing a lot of damage. I've already taken 300 HP off. I do want some more cooldown so I can do that a little bit better. Okay. All right. I don't mind getting the Aegis there. I'm just going to go full commit on this blue buff really quick. Probably still won't be able to get it. Because of that. Oh, he hosted someone. All the streamers that I'm watching are hosting other people. To be fair, it has been three hours and 40 minutes, so it makes sense. Not gonna kill me, Bozo. Get this 
his XP camp, and then we'll go get Serrated. Serrated also gives me a little bit of sustain, which might be helpful. I will probably... Well, I don't know. I guess I'll probably need a beat stick, but... Oh, he's going double lifesteal. Okay, maybe I will go beat stick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am seriously just going to stand here and hit tower. That did 151 damage. How much does this do? Yeah, that does about 100. And that does 75, 76. I'm doing a lot of damage to this thing. Okay. Wow. Well, killed anyways. Unlucky. Yeah, I definitely need a beat stick. Or I might just go Jotun's. I'm not quite sure. My auto attacks actually do as much as his poly autos do. When there's not minions in there, obviously. When there is minions, those bitches chunk. I have 20% cooldown. Mm. Yeah, my dude just came out fucking swinging. My ult only did 800. Not too great. I don't think I can take Fiend or take Tower here. I was thinking initially about just running in there. But I might just poke it on the side. I don't know. This blue buff is also spawning. Oh. I am pretty far below, like dump behind, I mean. Damn, this full length pause. All right. Oh, that hit me. Ow. Yeah, that did a hundred damage. Ow, dude, fucking hell. My dude is just chunking the crap out of me. I kind of wish I did go soul leader in this game. Let's go grab beat stick. Alright, I got 30% cooldown with the blue buff. He just warded over there. God, that does so much damage. Did that unlucky for me he knows I'm gonna be over here all 
Oh, he doesn't care. No reason I went there. Oh, he's just poly autoing. I can do that faster than you can. I think. I can definitely do it faster than you. Maybe? Well, he has to take a tower shot every time, right? So he can't... Oh, he definitely can. Hmm. Okay. Um, I should be able to get Phoenix off that, right? That is one of the benefits of me not having... Well, I say not having to take damage right when I take damage. But one of the benefits of me not having to tank when I poke his tower down. Because he can do it too with the poly. And it, it does work. Don't get me wrong. It works. But, uh, afterwards, you just kind of die. And you actually ended up losing your Phoenix. I really want this. I unfortunately do not believe I can pick it up, though. I'm going to drop it and keep running. He's probably going to try to finish that off. I don't mind. Nothing I can really do about that, I think. Does quite a lot of damage. Nice. He killed himself on my three. Perfect. Getting that heart seeker really helped. And I mean, to be honest, he went triple lifesteal. And I had, uh, what is this? 95% anti-heal. So that was really, really good. I was losing the early game, but I lost every single early game today. That wasn't bad. I got out damaged by a lot because he's a poke god, but when it came down to fighting, once I had my build online, he just kind of died. Not to mention the beads really helped. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed this special of only assassins. And if you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, y'all, peace.